Hello, today I'm going to be talking about a topic that you guys probably already know a lot about. Nicknames. While I may not look like it, never mind. I'm sure you can tell I've had many nicknames throughout my life. So if you've been watching my daily vlogs recently, you'll probably have noticed that there's a hanging Boy Scout uniform in the background of my videos. Fun fact, I'm an Eagle Scout. But it goes without saying that most of the nicknames I've gotten, I've gotten from being in the Scouts. Also something to note is that people legitimately use these nicknames to refer to me or to get my attention. And it worked. The first nickname I've ever gotten was Happy Trails. As a Cub Scout going to my first Boy Scout meeting, I made the foolish mistake of wearing a Cub Scout shirt that said Happy Trails on it. Older Scouts thought it was hilarious that I had a shirt that said Happy Trails on it, so they started doing things like, Hey Happy Trails, my shirt! <laughs> happy Trails! The next nickname I got probably would make sense to you. Funny face. Yeah, older scouts used to call me funny face, mostly because I have a funny face, and because my first year as scouts, I forgot to bring my mess kit to summer camp, so to get a drink out of the giant fruit punch container, I kind of just bent over and drank it, and then I ended up having a very red face, and they thought it was a funny face, and they ended up ostracizing me during a giant skit and saying that I was the hideous one, and I just agreed with it because I had a funny face. Next up is a nickname I got during my freshman year of high school. I was the only freshman male to actually make the cut in the musical, and I wasn't always six foot four or however the frick tall I am. I used to be five foot five. Meow. So being the midget that I was, no offense to people that are actually shorter than that, but the seniors in the class ended up calling me Ernie, like the Keebler elf, forever alone. Back to Scouts, during my second year of summer camp, for some reason or another, I decided to wear this ratty old pair of penny loafers, which I know are absurd, for an entire week of summer camp, and I quickly got the nickname Loafer Boy. I don't want to be a loafer boy. One day during my third year of scouting, I accidentally forgot to wear my scout pants to a meeting, and I wore this incredibly bright red pair of pants. Henceforth, for three years, I was referred to in the troop as Hot Pants. Whenever someone would mention my name, older scouts would always correct them and go, his name's Hot Pants. And then they'd go, Hot Pants. And they would touch their pants. Hot Pants. When our patrol was picking patrol names for the 2005 Jamboree, our patrol decided to do the dragons. And I really wanted to draw a logo, so I drew Trogdor the Burninator. And for some reason, everybody thought that was really lame. And I was like, no, he's a one arm windling dragon. The freaking Burninator. And because I tried so hard to get Trogdor as our logo, they decided instead of having our logo as Trogdor, let's just call Evan Trogdor, which is a freaking awesome nickname. Just saying. So basically all the scouts in our troop that went to the Jamboree decided to just say, hey Trogdor, Make sure to clean that urinal <laughs> At least it was better than hot pants. So during the same year, I realized that my name backwards was Nave, and that sounded pretty cool. So I convinced a couple of scouts and even teachers to refer to me as Nave. My last name is Ragnai backwards. That's why my username is Nave Ragnai. I'm telling you a secret, but I'm not really whispering. Something I also noticed was that my initials are EE, -E, which, being a math major, if you put them together, should be E squared. So a lot of people in high school actually refer to me as E squared. I'm a loser. When I first got a job working at the pizza place I do now, I was really shy, and I never really had a name tag. Now, a name tag is part of the uniform, so the cooks thought it'd be funny if they just made a name tag and said, Yerp! on it and gave it to me. I just wanted to fit in so I put on the name tag and the manager didn't really notice that my name tag said Yerp for an entire month. The funny thing was customers would actually thank me by name and go, thank you very much. Uh, yerp? And then I'd be like, yeah, my name's Yerp. Parents are from Africa. The last nickname I ever got, I got out of malice from some kids in my pre-calc class. I was new to the school and maybe sometimes I would raise my hand. Okay, maybe a lot of times I would raise my hand and ask stupid questions. So one day, one of the kids in the class said, Man, you're about as useless as a three-wheeled scooter. And somehow, the name Scooter stuck with everybody, not even in that class. But in the end, this nickname that was made to make fun of me ended up being a pretty awesome nickname. And to this day, I'm still greeted by my high school physics professor with Scooter! And you know what? I don't really mind. And I guess that's sort of the point of this video, if it actually had one. Instead of getting angry or upset about my nicknames, I kind of just accepted them and made them more awesome. So anyway, did you guys ever have any weird or funny nicknames? Leave those comments in the comment thingy-mabobber in the bottom. Otherwise, I'm gonna go open a P.O. box and edit this video. So, thanks for watching. See ya! Nave Regnied. So the- What the heck, car? You really need to be driving that loudly? Come on. Frick you, car, man. A, a truck now? Okay. Use this freaking driveway. Jeez. Stop passing my house! Go away! Stop it! Go! Why? Is this 
tractor trailer day or something? Come on!